Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many Python developers encounter when working with Jensen. Our viewer is looking to speed up the word mover's distance similarity calculations using multiprocessing. Let's dive into the details. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you find that resolution you need. Anyway, let's continue on. To improve the speed of Jensen's WMD similarity, we can utilize multiprocessing. First, let's break down our corpus into smaller chunks. Next, we will define a worker function that initializes the WMD similarity instance for each chunk of the corpus. Now we will create a manager to handle shared data between processes and start multiple worker processes. After all processes have completed, we will retrieve the results and find the document with the highest similarity score. Finally, ensure that your corpus is well prepared and that the tokenization of your query is accurate to improve the quality of the results. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To speed up WordMover's distance similarity in Jensen using multiprocessing, start by defining a static chunk size, like 600. Then, calculate the number of workers based on your CPU cores. It's best not to exceed the number of CPU cores you have. If you have 17 cores, that's fine. Use the CPU count to set your workers and adjust the chunk size accordingly. Make sure to handle the indexing correctly. The return dictionary should reflect the correct indices to avoid overwriting results from different workers. When calculating chunk sizes, ensure you don't skip the first document. Use a proper function to determine the chunk size based on the number of workers. Testing results show significant differences in performance with and without multiprocessing. Adjusting chunk sizes can lead to better efficiency. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To speed up WMD similarity in Python using threading, the user creates multiple WMD instances based on the number of threads specified. They divide the corpus into chunks for each thread. The user defines a function to perform queries on each WMD instance, collecting results from all threads. They then scale the results back to the complete corpus size. Finally, the user aggregates the results and selects the top matches. They acknowledge that while the code may not be perfect, it effectively utilizes multiple threads for faster processing. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you find that solution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it.
And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.